Hello everyone, this is Guy from MyPOS. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate to you how to set up and configure an X printer, Wi-Fi printer model. Uh, this model number is uh, XPN160II. Uh, you can't straightforward can say because it doesn't have a uh, an antenna or anything as such uh, shows us that it's a Wi-Fi printer but on the label it says USB plus Wi-Fi. Hence, we know that it's a Wi-Fi printer. Um, we plugged in a USB cable uh, into the point of sale to load up the initial configuration, which is the Wi-Fi settings and the net settings. So, uh, I'm gonna close all that. And you need to download and install XPrinter version 3.2C, very important. And then let's run the application. In the meantime, I'm gonna turn on the printer and give it a few seconds. Uh, it's not configured at the moment. So it prints this uh, a small docket, uh, which has blank gateway IP. Th there's nothing in it, just a, just a two line uh, print. Uh, means that it's not configured to a Wi-Fi network. So. On the, the version 3.2c uh, configuration software, I select USB, I go to advance, I go to set net, and I have my uh, preferred IP address. This is gonna be the static IP for this printer. Um, and the Wi-Fi setting, uh, the way it uh, works with my uh, Wi-Fi uh, SSID and password. And as for the key type, I usually select WPA2, AES, PSK combined. And to save all this conf con configuration, I'm gonna set all. And it beep thrice, one more beep. And three long beeps means that it's, it tells us that it's connected to the Wi-Fi SSID that uh, we have entered here on the software. I'm gonna switch off the printer and switch it back on. LED, three long beeps. You won't see any uh, dockets like this because now the printer is connected to the Wi-Fi network. I'm gonna to go to previously installed X printer uh, on devices and printers on the same IP, uh, 192.168.123.136. Uh, go to printer properties, and I'm gonna put a test print. All right, so we have the confirmation from Windows that the printer is now connected to the, the Wi-Fi network. Uh, and I'm gonna remove the USB cable from the printer. Now all it has is the power supply, there's nothing else. I'm going to try the Windows test print one more time. There you go. So it's confirmed that the printer is now connected to Wi-Fi. Hence, we can access the printer using uh, the printer that we have installed on Windows. So uh, something to remember is that not like the previous uh, Wi-Fi printer we have, which is model C2008, uh, this particular model does not have any antennas to distinctly uh, identify that it's a Wi-Fi printer. You can only do it by looking at the, the label here. And then also when it connects to, um, switch off and switch it back on, when it connects to uh, the Wi-Fi network, it has the LED and the long three beats. Apart from that, you can't say that it's connected, there's no dockets as such to tell you that it's connected but it will spit out this blank small piece of paper uh, to show you that it's not connected to the wi-fi network at the moment you can simply uh, connect configure your point of sale software now to talk to the receipt printer wirelessly uh, based on your application i hope you like this video we'll catch you up on another video Thank you.